Every single one of them has money in it. Thirty-one thousand dollars. Ah, no way. <laughs> oh, what is that? Oh, what is that? The owner has passed away. Three million nine hundred seventy-one thousand three hundred thirty-seven dollars. We just paid five hundred and forty dollars for an absolutely packed ten by ten storage unit full of boxes. Let's get in there and see what we got. I'm so excited to go into this storage unit. Why? They rarely ever have auctions. The last one they did, we won. You might remember that one. Safe with three thousand dollars, thousand dollars and half dollars. This facility is epic. That's why I'm so excited. Let's go through some boxes. I don't even know where to start. Let's see what's in here real quick. Come on. Oh, that's heavy. That is really heavy. This looks like a bunch of, oh, Ooh, what that, is that? That's signed. Ruth Warwick and Richard, who is that? Richard Schoberg. I've never heard of either one of those. Uh, Comet, help me out. Okay. That's kind of a cool start. <laughs> that's the first cool thing to pull out. Cards, bang, dang it. Just empty. What else is in here? We got a lot of pictures, pictures. We're not gonna go through all those. That signed picture is interesting though. Is this whole thing a photo album? Let's go down some. Photos, photos. Yeah, unfortunately that's all photos, so we'll make sure they get that back. Want someone to sit down? I got, <laughs> uh, uh, please, please don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. I got okay. us a nice wooden chair. There Thanks. we go. That's where we take breaks at. What's in these huge boxes here? Whoa, is that all art? Hold on. Are these prints or? Whoa. Look at that. That is actually really cool. Courtesy of Humana Hospital, St. Luke's, Richmond, Virginia. Are these all different? I know it's all the same one. You see that? Flip through. Yeah, it's yeah. like a million copies huh. of this. So I'm guessing these are prints, but maybe that artist is worth a little something because there's probably a hundred of those in here. Let's get, oh my God. It's this heavy, is huh? super heavy. <laughs> Holy, eat. You got heavy. it. Art's heavy. Whoa, almost broke the storage in the door. <laughs> now that looks similar. Yeah. Is it more the same? I think it's gonna be, whoa, look at that. So you can get an idea of quantity right there. Wow. That's insane. Is it the same one though? That's the question. I can't tell. Let's just pull out a few. Is it? Yes. So we have like 700 copies of the same print. That's how we start. I see a lot of boxes in the back labeled Texas. That's what I'm really interested in. Not to mention this. Like what? Is, what? what is this? Ooh, uh -huh. It looks like some kind of storage thing. It looks cool though. Is this a cardboard cutout? What is this? Let's see. We'll use our chair that we said we're gonna use for resting for this. What? Is this more art? No. What, what is, is that? that? I have Anything no idea. Else? What, you got an idea? No clue. <laughs> no clue, guys. What in the world is this stuff? This is some art stuff, maybe floor. It looks like a floor piece. I don't, <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> These boxes look like, uh, yeah, my, I, I thought so. <laughs> I thought, you know what? I'm not gonna be mad because I counted for this one. I looked at the pictures of the unit. This facility is great. They get up and close and they kind of show you. I could see that these boxes look like they had either nothing or next to nothing. That one has nothing. This one has the uh, top. Oh, that one has a whole doorknob. Okay. Nice. I We're didn't see the right doorknob. Direction. We're going in the right direction. These, yeah, I figured as much. Okay. So these right here are empty. This one too. Yep. Bunch of empty banker boxes. Okay. That, that stay, stay. Uh, you can fall. Then, uh, where do we go from here? What's in this thing? Just get the boxes off this thing. Oh, yeah. I want to know what's in that big thing right there. I'm really mm -hmm. curious. This, this, I did bring a knife this time, actually, believe it or not. I didn't bring it, she did. I <laughs> gave it to me beforehand. It's okay. Come on. You didn't have to say that. Yeah, I have to be honest, I don't <laughs> lie. There's paper plates, some VHS tape. Something's wrapped up in this paper though. Let's see what that is. Something cool, something cool. What the heck? Uh, it's a really old personal picture. The only thing we do with these is usually give them back, but a lot of people old times used to put money in picture frames. So we always open up the frames, look in the back, and there's nothing in there, like they're most likely 90% of the chance isn't. We just give them the pictures back. Your choice, this or this? That box first. This box, okay. Yeah. Clock is what it says on there, some other stuff. Let's put that right here. What kind of clock? Clock can be $5 or 5,000. You know, that's not very helpful. Is that what it is? Okay, that's an alarm clock, that's more $5. <laughs> <laughs> what else do we got in here? You made that harder on yourself. I did, didn't I? So in here, this looks like a bunch of files, paperwork, paperwork paperwork yeah all that is just files now we're gonna go through the mail see i always checking these because one of our first storage units we found a bunch of envelopes just like this that were open like that and in the very like almost every single one of them they were oh no i was just about to say every single one of them has money in it and that was 22 dollars is that hold on <laughs> hold on a second it's just, see, this is exactly what happened. These are bills. This is the exact same thing that happened. They had bills and they had the exact amount of money in there. I was just about to say we did the same thing and now we have a lot of envelopes open. Hold on. <laughs> really quick. Oh my gosh. What are these? They're all full. 
please. No, it ought to be folded up. Where was that other one? I didn't even see it. I dropped it. This all oh, this one just has a bunch of checks in it. You see that? Yeah. Just a hoard of checks. Oh boy. I get it. Such an adrenaline rush when I start seeing cash. Come on. I'm gonna open up a couple more. Then we're just gonna rip through all of them. No. Nothing. Come on. You can't tell me it's just one with money. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. I'm not seeing anything. Why do people do that? I don't know. Like it's just multiple times this happened to us. I'm gonna pull out one random one. If there's nothing. Oh, is that money? No, it's a receipt with checks. Okay, what we're gonna do? This is a check for thirty-one thousand dollars for what? Look at all these checks. Okay, Crown Banking. Let's see how much money do they have in there. Holy crap! Three million nine hundred seventy-one thousand three hundred thirty-seven dollars in a freaking checking account. Why? Okay, we're gonna go through all this and then I'm gonna let you know what we found. I kid you not, I just went through this entire thing. One with money, every single other one full of checks. And I'm not talking $10, $15 checks. There's a few low ones in there, but for some reason, there are checks for like thousands and thousands of dollars. I don't know what this person did, but we're gonna find that out. I wanna get to some of these boxes up here now. Now I'm in hyper mode. Oh, I don't know if I can move this one. This one's really heavy. That's because it's all stacked bills. <laughs> How does somebody lose a storage unit with that much money? Like, it's just crazy to me. How? Just how? Unless they passed away. That's a very good possibility. Yeah. We got papers in here. This is just nothing. What about in the cooler? Cooler full of money, right? Come on. <laughs> Come on. No. Nah, cooler, cooler full, full of, paper of actual cooler stuff. No, nah, this is all actual cooler stuff. That's okay. Let's see what's in the box right here because there's more underneath of it. What is that? Whoa. Whoa. That looks, old. That looks really old. What is this? What are these? Oh, they're cold. Oh. Oh, let's do this. Come on. Oh, open up. What the heck? An envelope in an envelope? Are you jo What is this? What in the heck is this? Okay. Mr. and Mrs. I'm not saying it. These are like invitations to something. This is something. What in the heck? This is some really fancy. These people were definitely loaded. You can tell already. Now, what's in the back of this unit? I don't. What was that card? Oh, what was this one? Come on. Come on. Come on. No, what the heck? It's a Christmas card. This is really weird. I'm liking this. There's another box right here. Let's see if that's more of the same stuff or not. Open it up. Come on. Oh, no. Paper. Paper. Pa what is this? What do we got here? Uh, what? No idea. It's just wrapped up so tightly. Copper? Is it just copper? Oh, it's something engraved on the copper. It looks like the invitation. Did they give out copper <laughs> invitations? <laughs> who's like whose stuff are these people going to the president uh this is really strange i can't lie I what's in this huh? where that flower thing nothing, nothing. oh okay. no it's just paper weird let's get this out the way really quick what is down here some curtains two pack gourmet curtains for 25 bucks a piece okay that's 50 dollars. but that is just telling a story let's pull this guy down right oh pop, pop almost hit me right in the face well I, it did say office. I was hoping it wouldn't be office stuff, but it does look like it actually is. What is that? A letter opener? <laughs> yeah. What is this? You can use that uh, in boxes. Yeah, we could, but we got a knife. This is actually all office, like it says, unfortunately. So we're going to seal this one back up, put it right here. The next one is a summer short. So is it actually closed? It does feel like closed. But we're going to flip through it a little bit just to be sure. A uh, little blanket, some summer shorts, nothing in the pocket. Come on. That would have been cool. No, no. Nothing down there, but just more clothes. You want some tissues? I don't. Uh -oh. <laughs> Look at this old briefcase right there. That looks really cool. Let's start moving stuff from up here. What, what is that? Come here. A suitcase. Ooh. Ooh, okay, okay. I like suitcases. Is this a suitcase? Where's the tie? It is a suitcase and it's locked. Look at this. Or is it actually, no, it's just sitting on the zipper. Why do people do that? <laughs> they just put locks on there, but they don't actually lock it. Don't show that, but let's look inside some of these front zippers first. Anything? Oh, I do feel something. Nope, never mind. It's just part of the bag. In here? Come on. No, but it's definitely not an empty bag. So let's open it up and see what we have on the inside. That's the big question. Where's this thing open at? Right here? Come on. We need cash. What is this? Oh, it's another section. What the heck? Is this like a brand new bag? What is in here? Uh, nothing? Lint? Oh, I am so confused. I thought it wasn't empty, but it's just the thing inside, part of the bag moving around. So, but this on its own? No, this thing is heavy. I'm telling you, we're doing something wrong. Like, there's another section we're not seeing. What is that? Just papers? 
There's no way. I guess it's just the weight of the bag. I don't know. I am like extremely desperate to get into here. So we're gonna start going through some of these boxes right here, especially after finding the freaking money. Where did I put the knife? Did you take the knife? I didn't. No, okay, I got it. <laughs> I just hit him behind my phone and my $22. Gonna buy a month after here. <laughs> $22. Let's see, what's, what's in here? That's One lunch. Day. Huh? That's lunch. That's exactly lunch. We're going to some mission barbecue <laughs> after here, right? Yeah. What the heck is that? Put this down so I don't stab myself. Ooh. What in the heck? A mirror? Fancy it's like mirror. a bamboo type mirror. What's up, yo? Uh-oh. <laughs> that's kind of cool. That's the only thing that's in there. Weird, but unique. You see that? You, you huh. see this right here? This envelope chilling in there. I'm going to be fascinated with envelopes for the rest of the season. <laughs> Just so you tell. Because the last one we found all the money in the safe, how did it start out? We found the loose cash. Oh, it was it, like thirty some dollars. Remember? That was like in a Manila folder. Yeah, right? exactly. Or, that, or a bag or something. I don't remember. I think That's it was how a it started. Manila folder in a bag, but it was like with receipts and stuff, right? Yeah. What is this? Just canvas? I guess an uh, unused canvas. Starting to get the. Oh no no no! It opens. Oh look no, it's just two. Two oh. of them are both unused. Starting to get the feeling this person might have been in like art dealing because that's some high money business right there. Yeah. What is this? Oh, these are um, baby pictures on this side, so oh. I'll make sure they get that back. What else is down here? These are, are these all pictures? Let's find out. No. They're like they're bags. Look. Are they bags or like unused canvases? They oh. look like something you put art into me. You know oh, what I mean? Yeah, true. They're definitely I don't hits. Know. That's all that's in there is a bunch of these and some random folders. Are there any? I see a manila envelope. I'm not <laughs> leaving a manila envelope. Uh-uh. Let's see. Anything in here? Just a bunch of like, what is this? This is free. This is a catalog for an art gallery. There we go, right there. I knew that's what we were getting into okay. right here. And this is a bunch of just protectors and things like that. So we're definitely dealing with somebody that dealt in art. All right, because I'm impatient and desperate, I scooted these boxes forward because I have to know what's inside of this right here. No, hold on, well, let me go on the other side. All right, let's, you do that. <laughs> yeah. Okay, what do you, what, what's your guess? Uh. <laughs> Um, let's, uh, Do you have a guess? I mean, I would say art really? stuff, yeah, art I mean, cases. I, art I don't stuff. know. Let's see. Uh, Nothing. Oh, what is oh, that? What is that? What is this? Porter cable. Um. Well, that is actually what's in there. The but, sander. Okay. Nothing else but this thing right here. I like this. I feel like we could definitely put this in our like little auction room. It'll help store a lot of stuff. We gotta pull out the suitcase down there. Whoa! This is perfectly hiding. Cool. That's. Ooh, what is that? What is this? Uh, First, to look at the brand. What does that say? Uh, Starflight. Uh, don't tell me. Okay, it opens. Is it empty? Or it... let's see. Why won't it open? It's unlocked. What the heck? Is this got to scoot to the side? Uh, look. Magic? Oh, there it goes. <laughs> is it new? What does this say? This is actually used. Wow, a long time ago. But. That's just an old vintage suitcase with some pens and pencils, a little bit of paper, and a rubber band. These are literally giant blank poster boards. You see poster boards, I see potential for amazing $1 yard sale advertising. <laughs> Imagine going down the road and seeing a yard sale sign like that. That's a freaking billboard right there. You know what? I think we should give it a try at our next yard sale because why not? What is wood this is definitely art of some sort isn't it yeah okay let's get this tape off without damaging it right here something crazy in between there no what look That's what it's just a piece of wood no way is there something that's coming apart no this is just a piece of wood maybe it was cut out to be like the backing of a potential art piece they were supposed to get didn't end up getting something like that i don't know but that's just a piece of wood let's slice open this box right here and see what's inside nothing all right and well it looks like i just sensed that okay there we go more art stuff but like not stuff that was actually put in there yet it's like potential art frames art casings this maybe might be something art related or maybe it's just paper i don't know if it's done already or if it's just blank let's find out blank and blank you know what more yard sale marketing. Clear tote or dirty box? Clear, Clear tote. tote. Let's yeah. see. Oh, it's, uh, well, that's heavy. Why is it so heavy? Let's see. Well, paint brushes, screwdrivers. Is that an old tape gun or something? Looks like a really old tape gun, doesn't it? Yeah. Uh, office supplies. And well, more random 
office supplies and just pieces of metal. This has that smell of old metal. What is it? Uh, <laughs> hold on one second. Hold on one second. Let's see what this is really quick. Dang it. Just a card. Now let's go to the box you didn't pick. Oh, slides and photos. That's not good. Oh, Manila envelope. What do we just say? Oh, <laughs> there's some addresses. Nothing in there besides, looks like a funeral thing. Oh, there's another card. What's in here? Anything? No, just a card. We're gonna open like three and see if we can find anything inside. And if we can't, we're just, ah! Oh, no <laughs> way! <laughs> is that real? That is real. Hold on a second. We are now at $42 right here. Look at that, bang, smackaroo. Okay, now we're gonna open a couple more. I was about to say one more, but now they got me excited. Why do people leave money and stuff? I don't understand it. What about here? Anything? No. Pictures, pictures, pictures. No more cards. No more cards. We'll make sure they get their pictures back, but that's $42. You better have left this video a thumbs up right now. I'm telling you, there's more money in here. I want to get to this blue box. Oh my gosh, that's really heavy. I want to get to that blue box because the other blue boxes had more in it, but whatever's on top of it's heavy or whatever's in the box, I'm not sure. All right, come down. Come down, friendly. Come down, friendly. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Let's see what's in here. Just clothes. These look like clothes and shirts and things like that. Nothing in there. This is gotta be where the weight's coming from then. What's in here? Oh, it's locked. Where'd the knife go? <laughs> it's locked. <laughs> it's locked. It's taped. <laughs> it's, you can tell I do this too much? <laughs> Not, more photos, huh? Are these all photos? Let's see. Ooh, I see envelopes. That's what I see. That's what I see. Anything in here? No, these are unused, aren't they? A lot of storage units have these. I never heard of people doing this, but after buying enough storage units, a lot of people like pre-buy cards. It's crazy to me. Like, I bet you it's unused, right? Yeah, never even signed or anything. <laughs> Just get them ahead of time. It's kind of weird. Then we got a bunch of magazines. What is that? That thing, envelopes. That's not the kind of envelopes we're looking for. What about this little box? Cards? Cards? Yeah, just cards. This box has prospective gifts on it, which is kind of strange, but I'm definitely interested to see what's in there now. So we're gonna keep chowing down this big tower here. What is all that written on there? I don't, I don't even know. know. Whole bunch of stuff. Bathroom, artifacts, what? <laughs> I mean, I leave artifacts in the bathroom too. I'm <laughs> thinking I would wanna keep them. This is mostly like fabric and art and things like that. Yeah, you got it, huh? <laughs> Put that right there. Let's go to this one now. Oh, what does this one say? This is dining room, dishes, survival. survival. Ooh, a survival. That's the same thing with the other unit. It is. That's so weird. Let's use a little trick we like to do. Learn from storage auction pirate. And they like to look at the dates on the paper so you can see how long this stuff's been packed away. December 5th, 2012. So over 10 years now. Been there for quite a while. Let's see, let's open up one of these. What is that? Ooh, what are these? Oh, they're coasters, aren't they? These are like little coasters. Where's this survival at in here? I see a lot of dishes. What are the dishes? Are they anything special? Made in China. Doesn't give me a brand though. Hmm, that looks like bowls right here. Ah, all I see is dishes. I don't see survival. I mean, I guess you could use the plate as a weapon if you had to in a survival situation, but that's all I saw. Pulled this stack of boxes closer so I can try my best to get them down without getting myself crushed or damaging anything. This is a skill right here. Oh, okay, there we go. Let's see what's inside these boxes. This says what now? Sony camcorder? With that? Oh yeah. Let's go. Come on, please actually be in there. Please actually be in there. Uh, how, why is it like this? Is that Velcro? It does. All right, I see, oh, there it is. It's an older one, but it's in there, all right? Check that out. Mm -hmm. An old Sony camcorder with a bunch of tapes, charger, everything's in there. That's awesome. That's a good find right there. Set it down there. This is random fabrics, random fab, ooh. That, what is this? What is that? Let's see, open up, what does that say? transfer uh, i don't know what that means it's just a tote bag folded up like that for some reason that's really strange there's a lot of strange things in here anything in these front pockets right here let's check it out come on oh no what is that what is that just hand wipes what about the other one there's got to be something cool in there i think no all right nothing else in this box but we pulled down two so let's just open the other one right up oh <laughs> this 
the other unit, man. Remember how many like random seeds and outdoor stuff like this we had in the one that had, we found the money, it was at this facility, found the money, found survival, found food in the back, there were safe coins and everything else. And you know what? I still think it's gonna be in here. Let's take down the next box here. Oh, this one's gonna, ooh, look at that up there. That's interesting looking. Let's see, electrical. Or does it say that? No, it says elective. Oh, what? Uh, that. <laughs> that. We're just gonna say that. We don't really know. Let's start pulling some stuff. What was There's that? Something in there. <laughs> I thought that was packing material. Ah. Well, that was a light bulb. <laughs> it was. Keyword was a light bulb. <laughs> well, that, that's what happens. Some business cards. Oh, okay. I see business card art stuff again. This right here. What are these? Are these all? What are pop rennets? What is that? I have no idea. Um, let's see. Pop rennet? Don't throw it. I won't. I'll try not to. Uh, what the heck are they? They look like this. There's a bunch of them in there. Heck? I don't I have, have no, no idea. That's what this is right here. Really random. Okay. This German Christmas ornament? Is it in there? Let's see. Oh, it Ooh. is. There it is. It says on there, anyone that speaks German can translate that into English for us. I'm not sure what that is, but we'll put it back in there. I see a box of the receipt on there. I'm just running out of places to put things right now. Let's put it all right here, and then we'll go into that. It's okay. it's okay. All right. Triangle? Uh, what is that? Come here. What's the house one? I was kind of hoping it would be a camera, but whatever's in here is not the house one. It's super light, if anything. Let's see. No, just the pieces to it. It definitely was the house phone at one time. It has different receivers and stuff to it, but no actual phone. Down here, look at all these jump ropes and stuff. Right there. Bunch of jump rope bungees, actually, now that I have a light. I can see here's the bungees for the truck. Uh, what is in here? More light bulbs that I'm not gonna take out. That says electrical finish and booklet. No idea, but that's all that's in the box. I really want to get into this briefcase, but this is on top of it, and this is also supporting stuff back there, so we're gonna go for this instead. Ah, I gotta... Well, whatever's in the hard case just fell. Come here. No, it's so cool. Oh, there it goes. Thank you. Come here. Come here. All right. Let's see what's in these two right here. This is... Bum, 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 bum. Is there more than one thing? No. Oh, okay. There you go. Pull it over. This, well, as expected, some art stuff. Receipt. Oh. No, just receipts in there. All right, let's get that one out of the way really quick. Let's see what's in this guy right here. That is a bag of some sort. Let's see. It's, what is that? A bag of bags? A bag, yeah, first bag. What is that brand there? Pierre Corden. Pierre Corden, and that means nothing to me, but that's what it says. It sounds fancy. It does sound fancy, I can't lie. This bag, nothing. And there's one more in there that's just a time. The brand on it says time. I think now I'm gonna take my chances and I'm gonna move this. I might live to regret that, but I wanna know what's in here. Please, please, please. Oh yeah, oh. that's enough weight. <laughs> this definitely, unless it's, okay, no, that's not empty. Stuff in there. Let's see, how do we open these vintage things? Button, all right, let's see. All right, well, it's not, this looks like something somebody actually <laughs> used for work, yeah. Well, there's a name, random. This reminds me of like the old movies when they're going like, honey, I'm heading off to work. World Health Organization, like vaccination That's thing. That's cool, I guess. So somebody That's was weird. definitely traveling. Like we said before, we could tell these people had money. This is a lot of Department of the Army. I don't want to show their names, but look at that. US Army something. Okay, so whatever they were doing, they are making good money doing it. That's for sure. Is this all just working? Now we're looking in there already. <laughs> appraisal for what? What is the appraisal for? Another type of painting too. It doesn't have a number on it though. But you can tell they're definitely moving art probably internationally. Either somebody here or buying from overseas, stuff like that. Oh, oh, oh there it is. No, oh. we find money in the stupidest places, but not in the wallet, huh? It's never in the wallet. Unless it's like $2 or something. Well, there is some old cards, this side. No, there's something in this for sure. No, there's some more stuff. What are these, what are these? There's nothing. These are IDs, we'll make sure they get back, and army cards. So, random stuff, that's for sure. Is anything else in here? What about like this? A pair of glasses. This one right here, look at that. Department of the Army, again. Yeah, I don't see nothing else in there, but it's definitely interesting and really telling a cool story. Here is the box, what's it say? Prospective gifts, all right? 
Yeah. That's, that, that's cool. Oh my god! This thing's like <laughs> 8 million pounds. I can't... And that little chair. Oh yeah. This is gonna go great. Okay. What is in here? Okay. What in the heck? Okay, look. See how I'm gonna steal the paper this time? I'm okay. proud of you. I learned. I learned from my learned. mistakes. See, I learned. <laughs> I do. I'm starting not to though, but I'm starting to move it. Whoa, what is all this stuff? What do we got in here? Crystal of RKS from France? Whoa. Cool. You can tell these people are well traveled, like we said. They were loaded for something. If it wasn't from art, then I don't know what it was. But they were definitely loaded. This looks like just stuff they probably picked up overseas to bring back here, maybe, as gifts for people. That's what it meant. It just kind of sat in here because they got home and they're like, this stuff's kind of cool. Whoa. Look at that. JB Rogers Silver Company. Is that silver? Or maybe silver plated? I don't know, either which way. That's pretty cool. This box is about to get interesting. Let's get it on the floor. I wanted to move it and get it on the floor so nothing fell. But as you can see, uh, this one's tape shut. This is old stuff too. Like it's just old like crystal wear. Like maybe, maybe they were in the military. Maybe not, but they definitely picked it up out of country. What is that, a Super Bowl napkin? <laughs> Did they go to the Super Bowl too? Did that say 399? Hold on. January 26, 1992. Whoa, that's wow. before we were even born. You see that though? What? This three three ninety nine. They're not little nines either. No, is that four hundred dollars? That's insane. This is the kind of thing that you'll find like a Look. silver set in. Four hundred ninety nine bucks. Four ninety nine with two zeros after it. Yeah, look at that. What in the world? Christian Arkees, the same thing. I'll just leave it in there. This is insanity. I think that's the one I showed first. Oh my gosh, it gets bigger. It gets bigger. There's another crystal one. What else do we got going on? Come on, something cool. Something cool. Something cool. Open up. Oh my gosh, they put a lot of paper on it. I guess that should be a good thing, huh? Whatever it is, maybe it's really fragile. Oh, are these silver? Are these silver? No, I don't see nothing written on the blade. It does say something right there. It says 16-8 Japan, but that's cool. So Japanese knives, I'm telling you, I feel like there's gonna be a silver set in here. <laughs> and if it is, this unit's doubled already before we even do anything. What's this one? Come on, sterling, sterling, sterling. We want sterling. Come on. It does feel like it. It might be part of that same Japanese set though, but we'll see. Open up. Come on. Oh my gosh, there's a fork. I see a fork sticking out of it. I'm gonna pull it out and see. This says on it, I can't read it. Supreme by Toll something Japan. But it doesn't say anything about it being silver or nothing. You could usually tell by looking at it. That looks like it's steel, to be honest with you. But that's definitely a bunch of the same set. I just stabbed myself with the fork. That's lovely. What else is in here? What is that? Uh, grater. A grater? Is that really what it is, though? Yes, it is. Oh, yeah, it is. Okay, hold on now. This is getting insane right now. I'm starting to, you know, just freak out a little bit. What is this? What is this? Come on, this is more silverware. You hear that? Again, I could tell you by looking at it. This is steel. Part of the same set, too. I don't know, but there's some silverware sets that aren't sterling. They're still worth a ton. Oh my gosh, that's heavy. Feels like more of the same, but I'm gonna open them all up because like I said, one of these silver silverware, whole units paid for is money, plus more. So we gotta check them all. Come on, come on. Let's see, let's see. There it is. Same thing written on it. Can you see like the other ones, like all these spoons and knives, like is there, could it be a mixed set of steel and silver? It looks like it's all the same thing. Look, I doubt you're gonna be able to focus on that. You could try if you want. You see it's that? It's probably too glary. Yeah, it's something, whatever that says is written on every single piece. Yeah, in I this. What is this though? I see something with a different pattern down here. No, this one right here still just says Japan on it. Designer stainless, or um, stainless. What about these? That's what I just pulled out. Oh, the thing. flower one? Yeah, okay. it's still um, stainless, but it's all Japanese. So it's probably picked up from Japan, if I had to guess. Whoa, what is that? That's got some real weight to it, actually. What is this? Just a dish. Okay, it doesn't have any maker on it or nothing. That's kind of weird. What else do we got down here? Come on. This thing, what is this? Ooh, let's see. Put that down. What do you think this box is? I don't know. How's it open? Oh, it opens over here. Let's see. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. What is it? What is it? Uh, a giant, like, thermometer? Is that Batteries came out. <laughs> yeah. A giant cooking thermometer. All right. We're gonna, I'm gonna pull out a couple more. If it's not cool stuff, we'll just dig to it and let you know if there's anything interesting at the bottom. Pills. What is this? 
Okay, we'll open this one right here. Looks like it might be a dish. If it is, we'll just give them to it ourselves. Yeah, just the dish. But the bottom says that. Can you see that on camera? If anyone recognizes that, definitely let us know down in the comments. Think I can do an old magician trick and like pull this tote <laughs> fast enough to where that stuff falls straight down? Uh, you can try, but Ready? be careful, please. Set. That didn't quite work. It worked a little bit. Yeah, it worked a little it bit. It didn't go anywhere. Good job. Anywhere dangerous. I want to see what's in this coat right here. This is what? It looks like maybe for dress clothes? Yeah. Okay, that's that's that. Let's put that over here. But now I think we can get to some of these other boxes that are on top, that were on top of it. Like this guy right here. Let's see what's in here. Come on, Toe. Come on. Come on. Come here. Come here. All right. What's in here? This one's really random, isn't it? Mm -hmm. A lot of, what is all that? Just crafting stuff? Yeah. What's in these boxes with these writing on, foreign writing on it? Nothing. Weird. This is definitely strange stuff right here. Well, this is all just fabric and the rest of it is just like random books this? and papers. This looks like the same thing that was written on there. Uh, I don't know, look at the side of it. Is it open like this? Uh, come on. Yeah, it does. Look at that. Open up. Well, it looks like once upon a time it was something cool, <laughs> but whatever was supposed to be in there is not no more. I moved the top box because it just said bed sheets and I could see through it and that's exactly what it was, so we didn't want to look at bed sheets. This one, I hear a little bit more rattling. Where did I just put that knife? Let's see. Come here, buddy. So we want to check the rattling out, see what that is. This is a golden box. Okay. Uh, <laughs> what the heck is this? Nothing, no description. So random. What are all these little things? Just like little hardware pieces to fix things around the house. It looks like, huh? Yeah. I think that's pretty much a hole that's in there, but it sure made a lot of rattling. Trying to peek into the side of this guy, but it fell over and it definitely didn't sound like clothes, so we're gonna take us a look inside. Faust. What is Faust? <laughs> I don't know. Me neither. Let's find out what Faust is. Fabric? Maybe in a foreign language? I don't know if they were actually Japanese or maybe they just traveled there a lot, but there's a lot of fabric in here. Uh, what is this thing? Nothing, really? Oh, there's something down there, all right. What is that? Big glass, let's get this out. Oh, yeah. Denard Grunning. Ugh, whoa, this is huge. Crystal? That's what it says. It says crystal and the brand says better jewelry, Bernard Grunning on it. What is that big old thing? Let's try not to destroy the box too much. Move this stuff out. Whoa, it's heavy duty crystal. There's a lot more to it in there too. Let's see, let's pull out the other piece. Oh look, it's a bunch of little pieces. It probably goes together and makes something. Look down here, see this big old plate? Yeah. That's a lot of crystal right there. Huh, I wonder if that brand's worth something. And what country that one came from, but these people have been everywhere. I'm gonna set this right here and then dig a little deeper into the box now. Let's see more fabric, more fabric. What's that box? This. No idea what that is. Oh, what is the, these are receipts. Not as much as the other ones, those are like $200. Whatever this is, not in there. But other than that, yeah, it looks like a bunch of this fabric for some reason, maybe in sew or sewing pattern. Now I'm not gonna show their personal paperwork, but we opened this box up and there's just tons of these planners that are from the Smithsonian. 2008, 2010, freaking 2009 and by the way if you didn't know that's like a big museum type area in washington dc so and these books are packed like i'm wondering what they have this many appointments for at the smithsonian you know what i mean the art thing is really starting to get them you know what i think and look at this box i saw it here sealed and i just felt like i couldn't open it i had to open it on camera because listen to that sound that just sounds cool that just sounds cool i don't want to show who it's going to or who it's from but let's slice it open you know this is old when it costs only 793 to send three pounds man this is oh what is this thought it was gonna be something cooler random paperwork and yeah it looks like just random office stuff taped in a box we just took out a bunch of tax papers all the way back from 1996 a ton and i now can see this box i can't quite read what the top says but the bottom is you know that's all i needed to see 375 to 275 something i can't tell if there's zeros behind it each is what it says so huh. that let's see what's in this box right here i want to see what's in these blue coats oh i want to see what's in all these freaking boxes that say texas 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 what did you guys do in texas or get in texas 
Best of luck. All right, let's see. This box is, well, random. These are, what are these first? This is a check for, let's see, four dollars, yay. <laughs> <laughs> that, this one, what's in here? Oh, this is the paperwork, the lower box, look. You know what, this might just look like paperwork, but you can be certain that I'm gonna look through each and every one of these envelopes, not here on camera, obviously, because it takes two weeks, but I'm not throwing away, so I'll go through every single one. A lot of paperwork. Ooh, that box looks interesting. Let's see what that is. What is in here? Sounds interesting, what is that? More cards? Dang it, I was hoping it would be like jewelry or something. What is this? Is that actually mashed potatoes? Nails. No, this is what everyone uses these things for. Nails, screws, things like that. Set it back down there. What about this one? Ooh, more, more of the same? No, look. Well, there's nails. Yeah, nails, nails, lots of nails, that's for sure. What about this down here? And there's something over here wrapped up as well. We'll get to that in just a second. So right here, belt, papers. That cell phone earpiece, is that really what it is? Because you never know, that could be lying. That could be cute for a gold ring, but it's not. <laughs> Dang it, that looks like a jewelry box, so it doesn't, it? oh, no it doesn't. What is that, a picture frame? That's what it is, a really old picture right there, I'm not gonna show. We'll make sure they get it back. Other than that, there is one envelope down here at the bottom that's ripped open across the top, just like the other one, come on. There's a bunch of paper in here, come on. No, no, dang it. I just wanna see what this is now. Is this all hardware pieces? Oh my gosh, look at that. Just tons and tons of the same type of hardware pieces. I'm trying carefully, I wanna get this box. It says two, whatever, 375 to 275 each. Oh, there we go, there we go. Okay, what in the world is this stuff? Oh yeah, you think I can sell this for 275? Should be able to get that. One golf club and some wood. What about in between the cardboard, is it art? No, look, it's just literally tons of cardboard <laughs> with nothing in it besides whatever this is. And that's just, well, it looks like it's the uh, instructions to maybe one of the shelves in here. I'm super curious with all the Texas, TX, Texas, 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 like what, is, what do they do in Texas? But we'll figure that out. But first, I wanna see what's in this blue tote. Let's go through here and see what it is. Come on, something cool, something cool. What? <laughs> yeah, there it goes. Okay, it looks random. What is this, a metal? No. This box here, let's see what that is. Phone wires, electrical stuff, electrician stuff, a bunch of white fabric. No, this isn't. Something's wrapped up in here. What is that? Surrender flag? Uh, let's see. No, it's just a curtain rod. Like, you know those things you put on the top of the blinds? Those rods? Nothing. I thought I just heard something rock around. No, that's empty. Let's see, what else, what else? There's a tarp, and then there just seems to be a bunch of wood down there. Really strange. So I looked up the ID card, I looked up to try to find the owner, and they did pass away. The first thing I found was an obituary from a few months ago. So unfortunately, the owner has passed away, so no telling what we're gonna find in these back boxes. 